Welcome to the Gamescape, everybody. My name is Jack, and today we're back in Phoenix Point. This is episode 15 of our playthrough. And in our previous episode, we ran the gift mission. Uh, it went very smoothly. We brought in three of our soldiers along with our newly discovered armadillo that we acquired from our scavenging site. And five turns in and out, no problem. Killed a few guys along the way. I did miss a capture. It was pointed out to me in the comments that I missed a capture. And so, yes, I did. I'm sorry about that. That first Arthron that attacked the Armadillo, we could have captured pretty easily. And that was my bad. Sorry about that. But we did get the mission done and all is well. We also got the Helios finished and it is here. We got a new Mutoid on board so that he can do some exploring as well as trading. And now uh, we had just finished defending this Haven from an attack. So we know there's a, uh, we know there's a, uh, colony here somewhere that's outside of our radar bubble otherwise we would have found it so it's either here or it's in here somewhere uh one of the two and we don't know which but that's okay so uh one of the things we do need to be doing oh i also figured this out this was just dead before we discovered it that was all it just popped up as the uh as our uh, bubble uh hit it it was just a question mark before and then when Sinedrian revealed all their havens it showed it but it's already destroyed so that's what's going on there Figured that little mystery out. All right, so that's that. Uh, today, we have some stuff going on. Uh, number one, we have a couple more blast vests to make, and then we're probably going to think about another aircraft because I would like to start thinking about a second team and getting them going. Now, we don't have enough mutagens for a second team, and that's just how it is, unfortunately, but we are going to be thinking in that direction at least. And I've been kind of considering how I want to handle the behemoth here. Uh, he's not spitting anything out yet, and he's not going to spit anything out for probably a little bit yet. He's going to eat this haven, and he's probably going to eat another one before he spits out his first aircraft that we can attack. Usually that's kind of the case. He usually destroys two or three havens first, and there's just nothing you can do to stop it. And it's just he's just going to he's just going to destroy him, and that's just it. So what I'm wondering is do we arm the new Helios with the weapons on the gift and let him kind of roam around down here, do some trading, do a little exploration in this area right down here. And then when he starts spitting out flyers, then we can move in and defeat them and hopefully send him packing and heading for the hills. He requires only seven disruption points and we've got one so far. So six more disruption points, uh, that's, uh, a lot of Karens or a couple of Bareths. I think that's maybe what we're going to do. So maybe what we're going to do is exactly that. Let's turn him back around. Let's put him back to Phoenix Point. Let's send this craft up to Phoenix Point as well. Okay. A little cutscene here. The behemoth munching a haven. background big guy big fella the colossal organism known as the behemoth has been infecting some human havens with a new mutation of the pandora virus while stomping others into du fine dust so far all, mil all militaristic assaults against it have been ineffective the back of the creature is swarmed by flying Pandorans, forming an, imp an impenetrable area the disciples called the Festering Skies. Scientists and Air Force commanders speculate it's guarding something. For the sake of humanity, we must find a way to penetrate the Festering Skies. Should we fail in this, all is lost. All right. Okay, let's do this. Let's go to Air Force tab. Let's go to... Let's get rid of these. And let's put them on Helios. And we'll send Helios down that way, trading along the way, probably. Uh, and then we're... Would you stop? Okay, we have our Hera uh, pistols. Okay, manufacturing. We're going to go ahead and build two of those because we need two more for our snipers. And then after that, I think, since we have everything we need to do it, we're going to... Oh, we're short on... Tech for another Helios. I could build another Manticore. 
which actually probably is is that better or do we go two Helios as an eight man team? Yeah, I think two Helios. So we need to get some tech, which we will. So for right now, we're all right. So this guy needs to come over this way and start scouting this way. And the Helios needs to come here. Trade. They were trading up tech for all the things they have, but that's okay because we're going to trade it all back. So it's not a worry. We're going to come here and we're going to take everything they've got too. And then we're going to come down here. Okay, there's our laser weapons. This is good. Um, right now, I don't want to get into anything too much with those. Okay, we want all your tech, which isn't that much. But it's some. And I, do we want to trade off? Uh, we have a, just a ton of food right now. I don't think I want to do that. Okay, we're going to come here. We're going to trade for your tech. Okay, that should put us in good enough shape. For this guy. It's not going to leave us much, though, is it? Let's do a little bit more trading before we pull the trigger on that. Uh, let's come here. Okay, let's explore this. Come here. Let's trade this. Want all your tech here. Okay, that puts us at 700. But there's a lot of places here where we can get tech that we can't or materials rather sorry so we're going to trade here we're going to now sell set sell back some of that for some of this at a profit and then we can start exploring bandit haven no hostile forces have been detected but there's probably some resources let's search uh 40 materials we're rich okay shield bearer champion Chiron Agni, that's Fireworms, with Charon, the Barith, the Corruption Node, all in play. Myrmidons and Venomous, venomous Myrmidons and Vermidon Eggs. Good times. Does that mean he's launched one? Does not. Yeah, he destroyed that haven. Now he's going to destroy this one too, which is unfortunate because that's a tech haven. What's ahead? Uh, Rapicum. The skill of facts of Rapicum has been processing the information recently gathered by the Haven Scouts and offers to share some of it with us in exchange for parts for the hallowed machines she's tasked with maintaining. Uh, give her 10 tech for some info. Yeah. Site add to the Geoscape, three scavenging sites. Here's two vehicle. Two ve geez, two vehicles. That's the fourth vehicle site we've seen, right? There's two there. There's one here. And then there was the one that we finished over here. Geez, I don't usually see that many vehicles on these. That's interesting. Are you guys trading? Nothing. Okay, another dead Sanhedrin Haven there. Um, hmm. Well, you know what? We're going to get down this way. Maybe we'll do that mission today. Okay, no hostile forces. We're searching 625 materials, 100 food. That's decent. Okay, now we definitely have enough to put a Helios in. Ooh, do we throw some of these in too? They're expensive. That's the problem. 105 mats and 52 tech. Or do we just go for the other plane? We don't have anybody to put on another plane right now, is the problem. So maybe that's not really what we need. Maybe what we need is to work on a training facility for our mutoid soldiers so that we can hire them in, get them trained up, 
and get them experience quickly. Can we do that? How much is a uh, how much is a training facility? Training facilities two fifty and a hundred. So if we built two training facilities here, that'd be five hundred materials. That would be two hundred tech. Leave us with plenty. Probably even enough to open another base if we really wanted to. Is this where we want a training facility? Do we want it here in North America or do we want it over here? We don't have room for the stuff here. It would have to be here if we were going to put it over here. Or we could even open a new base, potentially. Um, North America is very remote compared to where most of the other stuff we've discovered is. There isn't nearly as much over here. This is probably a better choice for a training base here. Got the satellite uplink. We got to research. We actually have living quarters here already, which wouldn't be bad either. So we build what two training facilities here, and then any mutoids that we hire in, we just hire them in here. Is that what we want? I think that's probably good. Let's do that. Yeah, I think that's fine. That's just, you know, we could build another aircraft. We just don't have anybody to put on it right now. Pandora's have initiated a raid flight. Okay, good. What do we got? A Charon? We're not doing anything right now anyway. Let's go intercept this guy. Looks like he's going here. Okay. Oh, that's fortuitous. We have a plane over here. Uh, let's get in there and help them. Okay, intervene and, intervene and eliminate the threat. We got a night mission. Uh, good rewards. All right, we have people to arm up. You need ammo. And good. Blaze, you're good. Valkyrie's good. You're good. You need a vest, actually. And you're going to need a, your point over. Your point over of encumbrance. Do we give you one more strength? Ten, ten of our mutagens? Yeah. 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 All right. Artemis, you need one of these. And some ammo. You have a vest. You need a vest and one of these and some ammo. Your point over too. Let's get rid of that. That's fine. All right. I think that's it. Widow's all set. All right. Let's do this. Let's defend this haven. All right. Uh, we're going to go ahead and recover everything on the field. Let's do it. Okay, here we go. We got eyes on a Chiron already. So Agni, yeah, it sure is. Sure is. Now those guys are blind as bats. As long as we don't get too close to him, he's not going to know where we are until one of his buddies finds us. Um, in that case, then then the gig is up. Once one of his buddies sees us, then the then it's uh, game on. But uh, right now, uh, he has no idea where we are and he won't know where we are. Their perception range is 20, plus it's night, so it's half, so he can only see about 10, 10 or 12 spaces. I can't remember if it's uh, 20 or 25, but it's not much. It isn't much. So, and our armor affects that and stuff too, of course, but uh, uh, let's get to here. Okay, Arthron, another Arthron. Oh, those are potential captures. Those are potential captures. We dash and dash to here. Definitely can get one of them. Uh, they're just 120. We only need to hit these guys twice each with the uh, stun. Come here. Let's see what the stun looks like from here. 
can't even see them from here. That's excellent. Uh, let's dash again. Pretty good. Oh, they're going to return fire though, huh? Oh, nope. Out of, out of their return fire range. Not a problem. Yeah, as long as I don't hit the, uh, hit the gun. Like that. Oh, come on. You're telling me I don't have that shot? That's not good. That isn't good. All right, here's what we're going to do. You're going to use your sniper rifle. Okay, you're going to come here. And I moved too far. All right, well, why don't you come to here then? And then a quick aim with the pistol. Uh oh, Myrmidon, where are you? Oh, he's right there. Oh, no. Ah, we're just all kinds of messed up here. Are you out of power already? Okay, well, I just completely messed this up. Completely messed this up. Okay, you have two actions left. Can't throw far enough. Okay, we'll come to here. Ah, oh, this isn't gonna do it either. Get him. No, I got his wing. Didn't get him. Did not want to use Boom Blast for this, but kind of have to at this point. I just blow them both up. He's down to half, so he's still going to get a shot. Everyone's in cover, but it's still going to hurt. Well, I mean, I'm not going to stop either of them from shooting, so... Nah, let's just do that. That's unfortunate. I really messed that up. Oh, wow. 
get their guns. No. And no. Okay, well, here we go. I'm gonna get, uh, somebody's gonna get ripped apart here. Unless one of these guys happens to help me out. Oh, good. Get the other guy, too. Okay, worm's coming. All three landed. He's going to go the wrong way. I mean, it's not the wrong way, but oh, that guy's doing corrupted damage. That means there's an Acheron around here somewhere. There's an Acheron around here that we haven't seen yet. But I can hear him. There he's over here. There he is, clear right here in the corner of the screen. Yep. Okay, well, hmm. That guy dropped some ammo or something, it looks like. All right, who needs to heal? Oracle does. Oracle's going to come right to here, and she's going to do this, and this, and kill. And then hide. Kind of left her hanging out in the open there, didn't I? Uh, Widow could also definitely use a heal. Okay, and then the Widow can also do one of these. Of course, he's going to miss this. Okay, take that. Finish him off. Um, Actually, you know what I should do is I should have him finish him off if I can. He jump there? No. No. Not even close. I just gonna have him do it because he's got inspire, so he, it would get everybody back a will point if he did it. It's okay. We'll let this guy do it. All right, eyes on. Nope, he's behind the building from us, looks like. Yeah. We need to do something about him, though, before he starts uh, summoning in all the reinforcements in the universe. Let's move you to here. Um, well, heck. You got no shot. Might as well move you to here. Okay, Valkyrie. Got this guy coming through. He's a brute alpha. Got another guy back there. What is he? Let's see if we can get eyes on him. Triton Thug.
Okay, let's see what happens here. Oh, well, that's some good missing there. What you doing, buddy? Oh, just gonna blow this machine up. I gotcha. Getting a little lag here. Guys over there, same spot. That building's too tall to arc a grenade over, but... Oh, hello. Okay, what else? Still something going on. I wonder if he I wonder if he called reinforcements. Yeah, must have. I bet you there's about three or four guys over here. Okay. It's a miss. Got any buddies with you? Got your friends. Uh, okay. Well, you didn't move far enough away. You guys missed. And I'm going to be able to get both of you. All right, we're going to have us a boom blast. And we're going to drop some grenades on this guy right here. See if we can get him to fall into the building and take even more damage. Nice. No, building's too tall. Did he die? Oh, he died. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's uh, go here and stun this worm then. Okay. You. Is that the one you already did? Yeah. Can you not see him? I mean, you can. Oh, he's... Is he alive? Yeah. Okay, that's that. Okay, he's good and good and stunned. He's out for the count for right now. This guy over here needs to be dealt with yet. I'm gonna move to here. And two, two shots of the sleepy juice on him. Okay.
He's stunned. Everybody's stunned, right? All the worms that are around me. Yes. Okay. Chiron. Shred some armor up here. That wasn't very good. I bet we can capture him. These two guys are coming out next turn. We've got one point. Not great from here, but if we move to here, it should be better. Or it could be just absolutely trash. Ooh, 74 for him, huh? Well, there we go. There's, there's some. Overwatch there. Oracle, you're going to move this way. You might be able to get their attention. Distract one of them anyway. I'll take it. And he's not dead, huh? Must be close. He didn't move very far. Bet I got his legs. Okay. Got some more here. one do I want? This one and this one. These guys aren't worth a ton, but they're worth eight apiece, and if you get a bunch of them, then it, it works out pretty good. Let's reload that. And you need to reload too. Okay. That's another good one. Any of these worms not stunned? Okay, we're good. we got here triton thug he's going to be reasonably easy to take down he's about the same but i'm not going to get them both um let's do this yeah kill this guy i'll try to kill this guy save his head yeah, I didn't need to use that, did I? OK, 
Okay, all the worms taken care of. We've got plenty, so let's dash. And then we'll dash again to here. One more shot into him. Should finish him. Nice. Okay, we can move a little closer maybe. Only getting one shot. You know what? Let's take our shots from here. They're not guaranteed hits, but... Pretty good. Halfway there. Okay, now what's this guy going to do? Oh, he's panicked, so he's not doing anything. Wondering if I should, uh, wonder if I should go get control of this guy over here so that he uh, doesn't start shooting my captures. Probably not a bad idea. Uh, you. Where'd that guy go? Where did he go? Everybody over here is good. Oh, this guy could use one more shot. Of... This guy over here could use one more shot. There we go. Now he's good. Okay, you have six points left. A double dash gets you to here. Then you need one more. That means you would have to hit a couple of times with your, your shot. Not likely. You don't have enough to dash. I think what we're going to have to do is just dash, dash. Well, you know what? Dash to here. Then another dash. Get you to here. That's two hits. That's 16 out of 18. He won't be able to attack. Yeah. You know what I would like to maybe do? 
see if I can ping his claw off just in case. There we go. Almost done here. Just got to finish off this uh, Chiron. Don't shoot my Chiron. Trying to capture him. Oh, he's out of ammo. <laughs> okay. Oh, you know, you're done. You can reload once. Okay. You hit him with the sleepy juice one more time. And that ought to do it. No? Why isn't that it? All right. It might be it. It might just not have... Uh, Uh, you're going to keep running away, so I can't get a hold of you, aren't you? Did one of the worms wake up? No. All the worms are still down. Down, 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 down. Okay, that's still good. Will you just stay put? Stop shooting my captures. Oh, here we go. We're over there. Ooh. Okay. 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 You get a hold of him. You run. Okay, we're gonna. How's he doing? He's twenty two sixteen, plenty of time. you rest for a turn get some will points back you everybody over here is kosher right you got six turns all you guys have a ton of turns okay yes i feel okay running off here five we got at least five turns over here yet okay everybody's good keep making me nervous when i spot worms that i'm standing right next to uh, i wonder if that's a merm did I, uh, I don't know. I don't know who this is over here. 
running along the edge of the map like that, it might be a... Did we have a Myrmidon on this? I don't remember. I did. I shot him, right? Maybe I'm thinking of something else. Who knows? Yeah, there he is. It's that disabled Myrmidon. Oh, he's not disabled, is he? Uh, he is not disabled. I'm on the move. He's just super blind, that's all. Waste the grenades. Better than him getting to our guys. Oh, he's too far. Probably not going to hit. Probably should have walked forward a bit. Oh, I did hit him. Yeah. We're going to move to here. We're going to let him make one more move, and then we're going to swarm him. In fact, you know what? I can sit tight right there. It's going to be just fine. You come to here. Nah, I don't think that's fine. Let's go. Attempting to reposition. Hope I don't miss. There we go. Now it should be it. Should have all those captures. All those worms are eight apiece. The Chiron should be about 150. And the Arthron should be 60 or so. Okay. Nice. Got the laser rifle. Uh, we did get our rewards. We got plus 10 attitude with Snedrian, which is nice. We got all our captures that we expected. Poison weapons, speed of development, advanced nanotechnology. We'll want that. Okay. Uh, found a Pandora nest site visible in the geoscape. Excellent. It would appear that diplomatic relations between Sinedrian and the Phoenix Project are improving. This seemed like a positive development to me, but I'm curious. Are you motivated by any kind of investment in our political and philosophical views, or are you just doing your job? Oh, we yeah, totally, totally agree with Sinedrian. I don't actually know if I want to do that, because I don't know if I want to run our reputation with New Jericho into the ground too much. Um... We have most of what we want from Sinedrian right now, so I think we're going to not do that. Okay. Ah, so our short-term goals are similar, but our long-term goals yeah, are not probably the wrong choice. Aligned. Or perhaps you are still weighing your options. Unfortunate, but not unexpected. All right, replenish all. Spent a little bit on that, but it's probably worth. Ooh, look at that; it's right here. Excellent. Probably worth it uh, because we got some good captures. Let's have a look at our containment facility here. Chiron, it's worth 150. That's what I thought. The Arthron, 70. Good. Fireworms. Oh, they're 17 apiece. I thought they were only eight. That's actually a nice little haul. Let's uh, put them in the blender. There we go, 373. That is enough to get a whole another team of mute, uh, mutoids going. Which I think we're going to do soon, but not yet. Because we have to wait for our, our training facility to be built here. 
Uh, that being the case, however, I do think what we want to do is get another plane going after all. And so I think maybe in manufacturing, let's go ahead and let's get... Can we go with another Helios? We'd only be able to carry five, or we'd have to run both Helioses together and carry eight. I don't know what the best choice is for that. Or we can get a Manticore and get another team of six going. I don't want to run a team of five, necessarily. I don't really want to run a team of five. So let's say... Let's say we think on it. <laughs> because this, uh, this uh, particular episode is already getting up on an hour, and... We've been going at this for a little while, so I think I am going to consider it between episodes here and uh, plan my next move. Uh, but if you've enjoyed this episode, do me a big favor. Hit that like button for me. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, too. And we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.